pretty much ominous. She brought us two brand new mimosas for the unlimited. You just need to be patient. Yeah, it takes a while. Oh, it's really thin boss. Look at that. All right, guys, so good morning. It is our last full day here in Nassau, Bahamas at Baja Mar. It has been an incredible vacation so far. We got a packed day today. We are gonna go see if the breakfast buffet is open. Honestly, you can't go off of anything you see online, so it might be open, might be closed. We also are gonna try to hit mini golf today. We're gonna go down a couple more slides at the water park. We're gonna go do this ledge jump, which should be awesome. We just got, I mean, literally so much fun-filled day today. So we're gonna take you guys along with us, show you some of the other great options at Baja Mar. We are gonna be getting out of here. Breakfast, here we come. We'll see you there. So we did make it to the Cleo buffet. I was hungry. We're doing the bottomless mimosas. We figured bottomless mimosas now or like $12 a drink at the pool. Yeah, 12 bucks a drink at the pool is insane. Well, I mean, or, well, Sammy's wine's like 15 actually at the pool. All right, so I'm gonna go show you guys the buffet. Kasha bread, toaster, jams, different kinds of muffins. So that's station number one. I'm gonna get some food from here. This is the first little station I just filmed. We got some banana bread, croissant, yep. This is the Danish pastry. This is that focaccia bread. Some pineapple, and then a muffins. I'm filming you mm. eating a blueberry muffin. That's a go-to. Oh, like banana this bread? Banana bread, which I thought looked beautiful and soft. Actually, and that looks pretty soft too. Oh my god. Really good. It lo that actually looks good. Yeah, I, I might have one of those. That. I highly recommend that. Mm. Eggs are empty. It's bacon. I think some French toast on the bottom. They're really good. Those are pretty. Grits. What are you getting? Can I eat an omelet? Oh, Maybe nice. I want an omelet. Spinach, tomato, and mushroom. So here's plate number two. They're pretty much shutting down. They, the front lady told us, look at those grits with all the toppings. The Honestly, front lady the told us. So pretty. The front lady told us that their last seating was at 11 and they keep serving, but I'm going to tell you they, it's 11 they, right now. They're starting to come. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're pretty much clearing down. How pretty my omelet She is. brought us two brand new mimosas for the unlimited. We're trying to really scram, cram those in. <laughs> now they do make fresh made omelets. With real eggs. Beautiful. We saw the real eggs. Try that. That's, that's their mm. chicken sausage. Mm -hmm. The chicken sausage is so good. This. It's really pretty. See that? That's my kind of omelet. That looks good. It's steaming. That looks pretty. Oh. My omelet's ready. Oh my god, it's so good. You're gonna die. Yeah, that's my omelet right there. Looks good though. Yeah, look at that. Hot. Careful, it's hot. It looks really hot. It looks really hot. Yeah, I, well, I could have told you that. Really good, I though. did tell you that, mm. actually. Look, crunchy yeah. bits of bacon. Yeah, I love they give like chives and cheese and bacon you can put in it. That's a lot of flavor. Okay, so it's not just me, that's good. <laughs> They're soft, though. Yeah. Really thick, though. Yeah. I didn't know what this was, but it's really good. It looks like an egg white bacon croissant sandwich. Mm -hmm. Yeah. My omelet's good. The, the uh, grits are really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, your omelet was a ten. Mm. So a little update. I have had five of these. I think this is, is this my fifth no. or sixth. I'm killing the mimosa game. Yeah. This was so good. I'm just so. Full. You see what I went back for at the very end? This I'm telling you, my two so favorite good. things. And this was for Sammy because I don't eat watermelon. We had that discussion. Oh Other than that, I left here full. Way better service than 24 degree north. Oh my God. I haven't seen the bill yet, mm. so. It was. I down to yeah, it was good. Good omelet. Good yeah, grits. quick service. I will tell you though, they shut it down at 11. She was totally wrong at the front. Kind of. When it's empty by 11, they're not going to be filling. Yep, so exactly. If still some, you can get it. Exactly. Breakfast was amazing. Okay. It was, again, as always, I stress it, it's expensive. Just know. Okay. There's not a single bill under 200 bucks no. for two people. Yeah, so we're gonna go try to get a reservation tonight at Sticks. Yeah, which is like their ch <laughs> yeah. cheap place. It's yeah, we're, yeah we're finishing off with the cheap place, which is still outrageous. And uh, we'll see you guys probably down at the pool. Second day, made it to the water park. Let me tell you, there is no one ever here, so. It's a little busier today, but I, mean, I just mean like, if you want chairs, Plenty of chairs. It's we're gonna like, do. It's not like Coco K, where you're like, if you're not there at night. Yeah, like, yeah, exactly. I mean, it's it's 12:30, and we're just hanging out. Island Essentials has pretty much deodorants and 
Band-Aids, Motrin, Tylenol. So if you need something, it's actually a good store. Another day, another day that the Clio Grill and everything is closed. The market is closed today, as always. So just to know, you gotta grab your raft and we'll see you at the top. What did you do today? Oh, my stomach hurts. <laughs> I'm not going to lie, yesterday it was so easy, today after yeah, that the, much mimosas, that was hard, bro. It's the mimosas and food. Oh, They're man. Just for breakfast. Pro tip, don't eat oh. a huge meal before you come to the water park. Just come here starving and then go later. Like we did yesterday, but that food was bad, oh so I don't God, know. Dude. So water park so far has been awesome. Other than it is literally 100 degrees. It is so hot here. It's so hot, like burned your feet. But we are going to go do the Pirate's Plunge, which is right there. That's the Pirate's Plunge. We're going to do that. And I think we're going to go find, there's this little cave area which shows some fish and then you jump off of it. It's actually like the Grand Hyatt's pool. It's not in the water park. We thought it was in the water park but it's not in the water park. So we're gonna go find that and jump off of it and we'll see you guys there. That's what we're doing. Every single ride has these little cubbies. Yeah, wear shoes. Wear shoes for one and then just put your sunglasses in them. And your shoes. And your shoes, you ain't gotta worry about it. So sunglasses, shoes, yeah, put in a little shoes. cubby. My feet hurt so bad. Yeah, yesterday, I don't know what it was. It was overcast, so it wasn't yeah. bad. Today is, honestly, I could cry yeah, it's bad. walking in this water park. The drop knocked the camera out of my hand. I had to open my eyes and find it. That oh. was the scariest. I was going so fast. Oh. I, I was going so fast. But they call it devil's backbone, I'm guessing, because you gotta have somewhat of a backbone to ride it. So here we go, a little nervous. I've seen like three people screaming bloody murder as they come down. But uh, doing this for you guys, here we go. Oh my God. I am, oh my God, I'm petrified. We're going? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> that was... <laughs> oh my god. That was the scariest thing ever, but it goes by within like a second. Yeah, you literally, I like, just saw you drop and then you were down. Oh my gosh. There you go, I did it. We did every ride but one. Yep, every ride but uh, one. The tube one where you're in the capsule, but we've yep. done it. Oh, I was wrong. That's called the Devil's Backbone. I did Thunderstruck or something. Oh, yeah, it was Thunder something. Yeah, yeah. right. Come jump. on. Do the jump. Come on. There you are, Hi buddy. there, pretty burr. They're the coolest things. Hello. So I got him. him. Oh, that's so cool. I actually got him. <laughs> Had all day. We have two. Oh, look, and they're all down here. This is literally it's more slammed than the water park. Those literally way busier than the water park. Literally. This is right outside the water park at the, one of the pools, the Grand Hyatt pool. Oh, it's a little chilly here. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, this is pretty cool. Here's the jump spot. 
we weren't dry already, we would go. I know, I'm really debating it. We were debating on going, but we're dry now. I know. There are just endless pools at this resort. Right, babe? It's crazy. It literally, in, oh my god, swim up bar, that's so cool. But the pools just never end. We are gonna get some ice cream. I didn't get ice cream at Scoops, but we are gonna get some ice cream and Pizza Lab. Pizza looks pretty. It's gonna be Wafer. my ice cream. This wafer's cute. Pepperoni pizza from Pizza Lab. Pizza Lab pizza. Pizza Lab ice cream. That's light. Is it good? Mm. It's a gelato, it's not ice cream. So it's always By lighter. the way, this is just a single scoop. Yeah, single, you did. She did like three scoops. <laughs> Single scoop. Yeah. Like standard pizza? Yeah. There you go, Pizza Lab. Little review. All right guys, so we came, we did not do mini golf, we did go and check it all out. We are gonna probably go play mini golf tonight. So uh, they're open till 10 o'clock, which is nice. We're gonna go do that. We came up, shower changed. It has been a great day so far. Love the water park. Just love the pools. It is so beautiful here. So I am ready. Sammy's in the shower. She's gonna get ready. And then uh, we're gonna head down, go hang out a little bit. We're gonna go get dinner at, I think it's Sticks tonight, which is a Chinese restaurant. So we're gonna show you that. And we'll take you along for the evening. See you soon. All right, so fill everybody in. What are we doing? All right, well, we're gonna go to Sticks and then Carson won on the slot machine. So I really wanted a steak. So now we're at Felina. <laughs> yeah, I hit a little hand peg. The little one. In the Bahamas, when you hit a hand pay, they don't yeah, they come in like you just, you just print the, yeah. like you can print the ticket. Like they don't you don't they don't take your social or anything. It's kind of weird. We're back at Philia. Well, we're gonna do steaks. Now. And again, so you're not gonna get chopsticks, but we're gonna show you some great food here, and uh, we'll show you guys food. So here is the Caesar. That is massive. Oh my God, way better. That looks that like a Caesar huge. salad. So you put a little pepper on it. Oh my God. Oh, I can't wait. We saw them actually hand making this the other night. They had a stand down there hand making it, so they must have already had some ready, but I'm gonna try it. It's really fresh. Nice. By the way, I wanted to make a side note. This salad is good for like a family of four. Yeah. We're doing the, we're doing a filet. And the cacao pepe. And the cacao pepe, which they make in a cheese wheel. Over there, I think. You gotta keep an eye on that, so I think yeah. you gotta. So there is the broccolini. That is the pepe that we saw her yeah, like making, which looks pepe. beautiful. Sprouts, 10 ounce filet. And the filet. Oh Look my gosh. Filet. It looks amazing. All right, we're gonna dig in. We're gonna split these up and dig in. Oh my god. Wow. Oh my god, that's perfect. That'll do it right there. That's better than Smith Malinsky's. Is it really? It looks amazing. I mean, look at that. If you're a steak person, you know that looks good. It's amazing. I'm not even lying. Oh, is it better? You don't have to chew it. Yeah, it's so much better. So good. Oh my god. So that was a steak, and then I can't wait to dig into that. Even we haven't that even far. tried that. They really char good. Oh, the broccoli. That's leaning. good. That's and a little bit of cheese. Yeah, it's really good. That's right up my alley because they love charred stuff. Oh, it's really thin boss. Look at that. It looks pretty. Angel hair. You're gonna freak out. Oh my god, I can't wait then. That was the first bite we've ever had of it. Way better than the um, carbonara. carbonara. Okay. Just honestly. Cheese. Oh, I can't wait. And so there like you go. The softest Everything tonight was amazing. So definitely come here again. we're gonna dig in and we'll see you guys at the bill. There you go. 240. That's at 15% tip. We obviously we tip a little more. All right, so I just want to uh, do a little update. We just left, what was it Philia? Philia, oh my god. My 100% recommendation if you come to this. Actually, the best meal we've had the entire time. If you time. come to this resort, go to Philia. The it steak, is the 10 ounce steak was huge. It was the like a 12 ounce like, steak. The pasta was incredible. It wasn't too rich. The pasta but it was, just was the enough. best meal I've had, I think, at this I resort. I don't know, in the broccolini. Oh, so good. Well, that's and I, you know, I mean, talk about pricing. That was as much as our breakfast, breakfast this morning. Ooh, our recommendation, Philia. Well, we were gonna go play some golf, which we're gonna go do, but the fountains started. Look how pretty they are. This is daylight fountains. 
So, we're here at Mini Golf. We did not realize it is $22 a person. It's 20 plus VAT, which brings in an extra $2. And uh, honestly, it's like a pretty serious putt putt course. We'll show you how it goes. It is not starting off strong. This is like a real deal mini golf course. Look at this thing, there's real sand. That's real sand, not fake sand. Also kind of cool, they give you a place to rest your drink while you're playing. Oh no. Awesome. I went from there. Mine is in the sand, but where is yours? <laughs> I went from there to there. Thank God I did an orange ball, I wouldn't have seen green. So there's the final, I'm up top. Sammy whooped me. I literally destroyed you. And Sammy beat me fair winner, and square. Winner. I would recommend coming here. It's yeah, honestly it's really, fun. really fun. It was a lot of fun. 22 bucks a person, including their taxes. So I don't know if it's worth $22, it was, maybe 12. It, it, was fun. it should be included, but it was fun. So uh, we'll see you guys soon. Game changer. Food to go. Oh my God, I don't need it, but I want it. Oh, it's going to be so you know good. What? It's the last meal. I was like, what do we Last eat? meal. I'm done. I'm not even Last two weeks. night meal <laughs> of, uh, of the trip. Swimming pigs, burger with an egg, and buffalo wings. They're so loud in this bar, it's unreal. Hot, not hot, good, not good. That's very spicy. That's spicy? Oh my god, I may not like it. Spicy but good. All right. So there you go. Swimming pig, late night food. And this is our struggle. I know. I know. They don't work. That was what I was saying. They're the worst room key in the world. They don't. I know. They don't. They, this should open it. I'm telling you. The map. Oh my God. Finally. 20 seconds later, we got into our room. We are leaving tomorrow morning, unfortunately. I know. We don't want to leave. So. But. We're gonna bring you guys a little bit of content in the morning and then we're getting on a plane yeah, we'll go to tomorrow. back to Florida. So the dreaded day, it is leaving departure day and uh, we are all packed up, got the room packed up and we are going to be heading downstairs, maybe go get some breakfast and then heading to the airports. We're gonna show you guys what the Nassau airport's all about, tell you guys how customs is, check through because we've never done it so we'll see how that goes and uh, just enjoy the last bit of our resort. We're leaving babe. Our cab driver told us the average time to get through customs right now. I almost stayed later. We we almost stayed later at the hotel. He said two and a half hours. So we're gonna try hopefully we make our flight. It's in like two hours. And I'm hungry. Also our cab drive there was forty five. Or to here was forty five. Yeah, so a little more expensive. It doesn't look terrible, but we'll see how it goes. Something that most people probably don't know is, yeah, the Bahamar, you don't need a mask, but a lot of places you Bahamas, do. Bahamas, you need a, it was Like a on the places. public transportation, yeah. here in the airport, you need masks on, so just something to think about, bring some masks. All right. It was, it, security was so painful. We're through, oh we come through the beautiful God. doors of customs. Customs was easy. Customs was easy. You can't travel with more than 10,000. If you bought anything over 800, you have to declare, declare it. Declare it. But it did take about an hour to get through everything. Yeah, it, it was seriously gone. We're gonna get some food. We never ate at the casino. So here we are, the Rhythm Cafe. Oh, you know, I'm kind of torn now. As always, Sammy's gonna no, change. No, 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 no. You're gonna change four times till we order, I already know. This is how you do it every time. I should start recording how many times you grilled, change your food. I want the grilled chicken burger. Right? I didn't even know there was a backside. There's a huge backside. You got sliders and burgers, signature specialties, and know, a single pasta curries, dessert. All right, so I wanted to talk about a couple things. For one, we were able to walk right out front of Baja Mar and get a taxi. It was 45 yeah, instead 45. of the 30 on the way there. Uh, a little bit about the casino. Slots were hitting yeah, actually, pretty good. like pretty well. Some nights we, they weren't, and some yeah. they were. But it's the table game. Oh my gosh, don't play a single great. table game. We would have a 20, they hit 21 almost every time. I mean, we there. didn't win. I usually, if you watch our Vegas videos, I usually win every time we play table games, at least to an extent, and I lost every hand every time right away. It was not fun, so I would not play the table game. Also, get a player's card when you go there. Yep. If you're gonna play at all, you have to go up to the Club Blue yep. player's card. Ask them if you have any comps after your stay. 
Um, and we saved two hundred dollars that as a room credit at the end, so they're gonna deduct two hundred bucks off. Definitely of worth it. And we didn't gamble all that much. No, so I mean, was, enough, but yeah, nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. Yeah. So the cab driver told us it was two and a half hours to get in here, which scared us. It took us, yeah, about, it it took us about an hour. So the security was so slow, it was unbelievable. Customs, it was fast. Through customs was quick and easy. And they were super nice. Now we are gonna get some food here, have an ice cold beer. So we'll show you guys the food and uh, what to expect. That's the chicken sandwich, and I gotta be honest. Just did not, I, I should have done the club. I was expecting a I little more. It club. looks kind of terrible. Yeah, it looks pretty. <laughs> These are the sliders, though. These are pretty. That is actually kind of cute. Honestly, it looks worse than it is. The chicken's actually really soft. What do you think? That's good. That looks way worse than mine. The bottom bun was unedible, and I love that. That's a lot to say. Yeah, that is a lot to say for you. You're gonna like mine way more. Top bun's not bad. Uh, six out of ten. Eighty-one. Food was five out of ten. Yeah. <laughs> it's like the only restaurant. Yep, is what it is. Heading home. That is if you come in on a Friday. The line is way worse. Great pick. Yeah, two right behind business. So close. Yeah, you can see the captain over there. So, just a little update. Overall, an amazing trip. Again, make sure when you go there, you've definitely saved up some cash. Just know that it's not cheap. Uh, you know, if you're trying to weigh the fact is a cruise or Baja Mar going to be more expensive? Well, you may think a cruise is more expensive. However, not a, not a chance. Do a cruise all day long, way cheaper than going to Baja Mar. But you, Baja Mar is not a cruise. But Baja Mar is not a cruise. Two separate vacations. Beautiful. Depends what you want to do. Yeah, it depends what you want to do. Want something that was breathtaking, upscale. upscale, and just beautiful. Go to Baja Mar at the Nassau Bahamas. For I, I did not want to leave this vacation. I was ready to stay and hang out a whole nother day. Um, even with <laughs> how much drinking and eating we've been doing, I really could have stayed a whole nother day and gone down the water park again right, and just hung out. So, you know, some, some final thoughts there. I just wanted to give you a little update. Hope you guys have enjoyed so far and uh, we'll see you guys soon. Alright guys, well thank you so much for watching our Baja Mar videos. I hope you guys enjoyed it. We will be coming out with kind of a recap, everything you need to know video, so everything will be in one place for you guys. After that, we are coming at you with some Bahama cruise content on Royal Caribbean on Independence of the Seas, so stick around for that. Check out our other videos and make sure to like and subscribe. It really, really helps, and we will see you guys next time.